Hello to all of our students in the School of Communication and Multimedia Studies in the Dorothea F. Schmidt College of Arts and Letters at Florida Atlantic University. I'm Dr. Carol Bishop Mills, the director of the school. And as we enter another week of social isolation and remote learning, I wanted to reach out to you to let you know that the faculty and staff miss being in the classroom with you. Every class takes on a personality, character, and culture that's unique to that combination of students in that class. As faculty, we look forward to discovering and nurturing that culture throughout the semester, as well as learning about each and every one of you. The connections we make in that course are what made most of us go into education. We are invested in you as students and as people, what you learn in content, but also how you grow as critical thinkers and as communicators and ultimately how you use the skills, knowledge, and talents that you develop to become civically engaged and ethical citizens in a diverse and ever-changing world. Speaking of ever-changing world, this COVID-19 disruption has been frustrating and painful for everyone. Faculty had worked hard to develop courses for you and then had to learn overnight how to develop and translate that information into an online environment. Advising, counseling services, and even career services are working from their homes. But with all of those changes, we know that the burden of the shutdown deeply affects each and every one of you. While we're trying to get our classes online, you're trying to be patient with us. While you're learning the content, you're also learning the online remote environment. You've lost that face-to-face -face connection with your fellow students and faculty. And you're learning not only the material that we put up, but the ways in which that information is delivered. We recognize the challenges that you face are significant, and we are grateful that you are forging ahead, sticking with us, and moving forward in your academic careers. If you're feeling disconnected, I encourage each of you to reach out to those who are here to help you. The SCMS staff and faculty, Advising Career Center, and even the Counseling Center. Those resources are there for you to use. So even though you're not wandering campus, please don't forget that those services are here for you to access. And specifically, in order to keep our SCMS community vibrant, we'll be reaching out to you in the very near future to collect your successes, your failures, your talents, your stories, and your insights. We want to hear from you in ways that we can share with the rest of the SCMS community. We are working to create a community through our social media and our website, and we're even exploring having some remote events that can bring us all together online. We hope that as we launch these efforts, you will participate if you have the time and inclination. I came to FAU this year, and it was the best career decision I've ever made. FAU is an incredibly special place, and it's not just because of the proximity to the beach and the palm trees and the beautiful buildings. Not even the ibises or the incredible iguanas that wander through campus. FAU is the people. And I know that it's cliche, I get it, but it is true. FAU and SCMS are filled with amazing students from diverse backgrounds with incredible talents. We have first generation college students, first generation Americans. We have third generation Floridians. We have DACA students. We have students who work full time we have students who have supportive families and students who are supporting families. And we have students who are doing this alone. We have students from all over the world and students who grew up in the vicinity of FAU, knowing that going farther away was silly when they had such a great university in their own backyard. We have servers. We have people who are working at grocery stores. We have telemarketers. We have punk band musicians. We have insurance agents. We have comedians and hip hop artists, athletes, film producers, actors, public school teachers and teaching aides. We have community organizers. We have salespeople. We have business owners. We have full-time parents. And that's just a few of the non-school identities that many of us have when we're not in the classroom. So I will send out requests for your stories and your experiences soon. So when I send out requests for your stories, your aspirations and your experiences for our social media, please share them. Let's celebrate this wonderful community that we have even in our temporary remote isolation environment. Stay healthy, stay safe, and please stay in contact.